What's up, guys, and welcome back to another episode of Super Cooper Sunday. This, you guys think this is a special morning just because it's Super Cooper Sunday, but this is how every morning starts. Every morning, he crawls all over us. Army crawls, lays down. He's a little wiggle worm. When he's ready to get up, we have to get up. And he has, he's told us now that he wants to get up. So, guys, today is going to be a full day in the life of Cooper and Coda, but this time it's going to be in 360 degrees. It's going to be awesome. I'm really excited about this. So, if you guys don't know, if you're on desktop, what you have to do is just kind of like click and drag on the video and you can look left and right and up and down and all kinds of stuff like that. If you're on a cell phone, I'm pretty sure you can do the same thing if you swipe with your finger or you can actually turn the camera and look up and down and stuff like that. If you move your phone, you can see different parts of the video. So the quality is not going to be as good as a normal Super Cooper Sunday, but it's still pretty solid for a 360 camera. And uh, this is by no means how all future Super Cooper Sundays are going to be. We just thought it'd be fun. I just got a new 360 camera. And we'll show you guys a day in the life of Cooper and Coda in 360. Coop, come here. Come here. Are you ready to start the day? Is it going to be a good day? Are you really excited? Do you want your puppuccino to start the day? Here we go. Good boy. Can you catch it? Oh, we're 0 for 1 of the day. That's not a good start. Here we go. We're going to try it again. Yeah, 1 for 2. That's not too bad. So this is about how every single morning starts. He crawls all over us, wiggles around, licks us, that sort of thing. I'm always the first one out of bed. I'm always excited to get down, start recording. So I get out of bed. Chelsea will hang out for like 20 to 30 minutes, just loving on him, cuddling him, that sort of thing. And you guys will see, pretty much as soon as I leave the room, he completely replaces me. So normally when we're both in the bed, he'll be down towards the end where he is right now. If I'm gone, he just completely sits on my pillow and, and gets all up in my space. So we'll see what happens. I'm gonna see you guys later. I'm gonna go work. Have a good morning, cuddle sesh. Bye, Coop. You took my spot, didn't you? Good boy, that's okay. That's a good boy. So that's how the morning goes. Then as soon as he's ready to get up and both he and Chelsea get out of bed, it's potty time. We really gotta go potty this morning. Good boy, good boy, good boy. Who's ready? So after potty breaks comes breakfast, and this is where the day really gets started. These guys both love their food, so here we go. We're gonna fill these bowls up. Boys, who wants breakfast? Oh man, hey, are you supposed to be in the pantry? I didn't think so. You guys are gonna get a, a full plus of your <laughs> Do you, do you have a foot in the pantry? You can't have that either. You're not supposed to be in the pantry. Good boy, you do spins for breakfast? Are you face clan? Here we go, there's Coda's, there's Cooper's. Good boys. Obviously, exercise is a major part of every dog's life. You've got to take them out, walk them, play with them, run them, that sort of thing. We like to make it fun sometimes, and we love going to the park. We've got a nice little local park that has big open areas to run and play and fetch and all kinds of stuff like that. So that's what we're going to be doing today. Not to mention that on the way home, sometimes we like to, to stop and pick up some puppy ice cream. So we'll see how this goes. Chelsea's getting the voice ready. <laughs> Good boy, Coda. Are you guys ready? 
You ready to go to the park? We're gonna go for a fun ride. Here we go. Go, 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 go. Go to the truck, to the truck, to the truck. Go, come here, to the truck. We're going in the truck. Come on. Good boy, good boy, good boy. Get in there, Coda. This is always my favorite part. Go, you got this. Tell us, would you like to hold the camera, please? Yes, please. <laughs> he looks at you for help. It's our life. <laughs> can you taste the excitement coming off of his breath? I can taste something. I can taste it in the air. It smells like hot, stanky dog breath in here. <laughs> Just a nice, a nice family day. <laughs> nice family day at the park here, guys. <laughs> so part of this park, there's still a lot of debris from the hurricane that came through a couple months ago, and part of it's still closed off because they took like all the down tree limbs and debris and stuff and dumped it in this park. And that's the part we normally go to. So we're gonna be kind of on a hunt for a, uh, a new spot. But you guys can see we do have lots of open area. Looks like some people are playing soccer over there. We aren't gonna mess with them today, Coop. Did you hear that? All right, family, I think we made it. We're in a nice little open spot. I don't see too many squirrels or anything that we can get distracted by. Coop, you've got some grass on your nose. Oh, you just ate it. Okay, that works too. Coda? I know you're probably not all that excited to be here, but we're gonna have fun. I'll chase you around a little bit. So we brought a couple of cool little toys. Guys, look down, you can see that I got a Frisbee, which is Cooper's newest favorite thing, as well as we have a little tennis ball launcher. So those are two toys for Coop. Coda doesn't really like toys. He doesn't like fetch or anything like that. So we're just gonna run with him. And uh, it should be a fun little exercise session. He's already tired. That was about 20 seconds. Good boy, Coda. Good boy. All right, I'm gonna take him over to the shade and then it's gonna be Coop's turn. All right, wild child, are you ready for Frisbee? Man, he is so excited about this. Here we go, you ready, Coop? You ready? Come here, come here, come here. Go get it. That's a good boy, Coop. Are you tired? Was that a good workout? Was that a good workout, buddy? Good boy. Koda, what do you think? Are you just chilling? This is his favorite thing in the world to just sit here in the shade. And it's nice and cool out today. It's, it's cool. Good. We've got a breeze, we've got all the smells. Good boy. <laughs> it's just so funny how one never quits and one is quitting in 10 he seconds before he starts <laughs> good boy all right what do you guys say i think we worked up a pretty good uh, a pretty good sweat here we're both panting pretty hard i say let's let's go get a frozen treat So the place we normally go to get them a little treat is either Starbucks for a pup cup, which is just whipped cream in a cup, or sometimes we'll take them to this Italian ice place. And the Italian ice place is closed right now. They don't open for another half hour. So what we're gonna do is we're actually gonna run into Freddy's here and we're gonna get them two small vanilla ice creams. Now, dogs can have the simple flavors like vanilla. Obviously, ice cream isn't the best thing in the world for you, so it's not something you should do regularly. But we decided we can make this an extra special day and these boys are gonna get some legitimate ice cream. So, uh, Freddy's drive-through, here we come. 
This is this is weird. 11:50 a.m. Yeah, can we have two small vanillas, please? In a cup. Hi, thanks for choosing Freddy's. My name is Maddie. Order whenever you're ready. Uh, hi, can I just get two small vanilla ice creams in cups, please? <laughs> You're gonna need to change your shirt. Look at him. Ugh. Look at Kona. <laughs> he likes ice cream. Thank you. <laughs> he keeps staring at the lady. Do you want me to get out of your way? <laughs> he likes her. <laughs> oh no, she doesn't like you. Oh, rude. But. <laughs> no kisses for her? What about for me? Don't wait for the ice cream. Don't wait for the ice cream. <laughs> Good boy. Oh, he got you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thanks. Have a good day. Just relax. Even though this is the dog toting, sand on your feet at the beach wearing, dog hair everywhere truck, I don't think we should eat ice cream in it. No. I'm, I'm going to say we should probably wait till we get home. So we're going to head on home. We'll see you guys when we get there. All right, it's ice cream time. So we're gonna bring this outside because I know it's gonna get messy. I'm gonna set you guys down right here. There we go, Coop, come here. This one's yours. Hold on, I have one right here. You guys ready? ready? Here we go. Good boys. Yummy, yummy. I don't know what you guys think. Koda, I know you're not gonna be involved in this, but I'm thinking that after running around, getting sweaty, getting all hot, I think we might have to take a 360 swim. Oh my god. How do you feel about that, Chels? I'm not How do you swimming. feel about having two wet boys? Oh, this is gonna be so hot. Today is a pretty, I wouldn't say chilly, but it's like, it's in the 60s for Florida, which is kind of chilly for here. It's been like that for like a week now, so the water is really, really cold. It's like that cold where as soon as you jump in, your entire body numbs up, but it's Coop, look where I'm going. Coop, look where I'm going. Oh, here he comes. Here it comes. Go! Good boy! Did it! You missed it! <laughs> While Coop and I are having our fun water activities, Chels is over here just brushing Coda. Coda, what do you think about this? Do you enjoy this? Is this your outside activity for the day? This is what you like? Look at the size of the fluff that is coming out of your butt. That, Watch, that came out of your booty. Watch, ready? Okay. I feel like we're playing that, how many licks does it take to get to the center? Right. How many shaves does it take to get Coda's booty fluff out? You got a big booty, dude. There he goes, now we got it. Oh, oh, oh. Look at Koopy. <laughs> All right, Koop. To end off this spectacular puppy day, we're not doing more swimming, we've gotta get a bath. So the lake is awesome, we love the lake, but sometimes the water stinks a little bit. It stinks right now, which means you get stinky dogs when they swim in it. So we're gonna give him a bath, you stay there, and then I don't know if you guys can make it out, but right on the other side of me, Coda's down there on the dock, just lounging. That's probably where he's gonna spend the most the most of his, his night here. So it's bath time. Nope, no swimming, come here. Nice try. Come here. We still have water. What's up, buddy? What you doing down here? You don't have to move. I'm just coming down to say hi. So I don't know if you guys can see it, but there are all these little fish here. We need to, I need to like come out and pull these weeds. 
but usually the lake is super super clear and you can see all these little fish swimming around and that's what he likes to stand out here and look at don't you buddy good boy look at all the minnows down there you see them and we have some pretty big fish we get like you know 12 14 inches stuff like that so he's got some big ones that he likes to watch if he ever goes in the little ones like the little minnows and stuff like to swim through his tail so all right guys i think that is a very successful super cooper sunday that was a lot of fun technically the day's not over yet but there's really nothing too exciting that's going to happen from here on out you guys saw the the post breakfast wrestling we're probably going to have some early evening wrestling then we're going to eat dinner then we'll probably like kind of hang out cuddle stuff like that and then go to bed so you guys aren't missing much but uh, that's that's what a pretty average day looks like I wouldn't say we swim every day or kayak every day but that's a fairly average day in the life no. of a dog in 360 so hopefully you guys enjoyed thank you guys so much for watching we are going to see you guys next week we're going to be back with a normal type of episode and uh, we'll see you guys there peace out